There are new developments on an election fraud scandal. Fox News first broke nationally for Indiana Democrats. Now officially charged with forging petitions for the 2008 presidential race. Eric Shawn's on that story live in our newsroom here in New York. Eric, good morning. Hey, Bill, good morning. Well, election fraud charges in a race for the highest office in the land. Allegations that presidential petitions that put Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton on the ballot in Indiana were faked. Four Democratic officials and political operatives in South Bend are now charged with forging names and signatures of unsuspecting voters on those petitions in the 2008 presidential election. Reports say so many names may have been illegally forged that the president may not have legally qualified for the ballot. The longtime chairman of the St. Joseph County Democratic Party, Butch Morgan, is accused of being the mastermind behind the forgery scheme. The Democratic Voter Registration Board Supervisor Pam Burnett and Democratic elections worker Beverly Shelton also charged, as was Democratic volunteer and former board worker Dustin Blythe. Blythe allegedly forged signatures on President Obama's petitions, but when we caught up with him last November, he refused to comment. Can you talk to us about the petitions? No, I'm sorry. I don't have anything to say. Did you forge any signatures? I don't have anything to say. Did have, you, did you fake any petitions at all? I don't have anything to say. Well, investigators say they found forgeries on 22 of the Obama and Clinton petitions that list 10 names each. Voters told us they were stunned. Is that your signature That's on this? not my signature. Did you sign this petition for Barack mm -hmm. Obama? No. no. You did not? No. So this is a forgery? It is. It's a fake? Absolutely. Well, prosecutors say the Politico split forgery assignments, one handling Mrs. Clinton, another then Senator Obama, and Blythe, John Edwards, whom he had met. But when Edwards dropped out of the race, they say Blythe was then assigned forgery duty to the candidate who would become the president. And if you suspect voter fraud or election problems where you live, we want to know about it. There's the address, voter fraud at foxnews.com. And when you find Mickey Mouse, come on back. <laughs> we'll do, Bill. See you, Eric. Thank you. Eric Sean.